Hello and welcome back to Pillars of Eternity. You wake to the sensation of being shaken and you open your eyes to see Ether standing over you. He stands just on your shoulder. He looks concerned. Your eyes are heavy and your vision blurred. The vague unease of unremembered nightmares cloud in your thoughts. You are not sure you slept at all the previous night. Hey. Hey. You're awake? Good. You were, uh, you were kind of thrashing around, eyes rolled back in your head. And you were shaking. I'm trying to snap you out of it for a long time now. Thought I was going to have to get a bucket of cold water. You, uh, you don't seem like you get much rest at night. You got those dark circles under your eyes. Well, not lately. At night, our dreams and whispers. Well, it's the watcher thing, then. I'm sure it just takes some time to adjust, is all. I'll try to let it sort itself out. But you'd better wake up faster next time. Trust me, you don't want that bucket of cold water. His smile is not one of a man convinced by his own words. But we managed to rest. That's important, I can say. Poor Mayor Wald. He couldn't contend with all that he knew of himself. A cruel fate. It may be my fate, too. It may. But Merwald knew the, his curse, for all that he succumbed to it. Perhaps he gave you what you need to escape his fate. Let's seek out these ruins he mentioned. We may find something of use. No, 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 no. I don't want to waste my... Well, picks too much. One well, is fine. Nice. Do I dare? No, not free lockpicks. Can I wait that older set? I don't want to discuss it. You really need to stop talking to yourself. Oh, by the way, you need to swap your weapon. This thing isn't doing the job. I'll also use this. I really do need to care, be take better care of you. Wait, it is a trouble. We don't need to use lockpicks for that. You can just walk around it. Come on. Think through your actions. Eesh. So glad we can what no 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 you're not going there alone at all anyway what's wrong with our formation do i not understand something because this is not what i set up Look. you still have those active right All of you, come on. Okay, so there is that. We are still looking for something. Of course, I forgot already. Um, mm -mm -mm. Hmm. We will 
will know once we find it. Weathered and covered with a dull patina, this elaborately carved pillar appears far older than the surrounding structure. Hold it! Yep, to the consecrated ground. Uh, you please be a champ and do this. Uh, use all of your possible spells on her. Kill her. Yes. I will also do my things. You will do your things. It might have been overkill. I don't care. Oh, it hurt. Still, it don't hand it fast. Hmm. Wait, um. Give it to you. Spider Venom Suck. Hmm. I hate giant spiders in games. Tiny spider. Okay, this one I love. This one I love with my whole heart. Look at it. How tiny it is. Wait, that, that is a, a hand. Oh, and well, we came back here. Okay. Just like your breeches, scholar lot. Uh, I beg your pardon. Nothing. I said nothing. No, 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 no. You're not getting out with uh, away with that. Olive seemed lost in thought. He flinches when you draw near, sucking a sharp breath through his teeth. What can I do for you? You've been acting strange. A crumbling castle, abandoned memories, and an old man who can no longer tell them from reality. I'd say we've seen some rather strange things. And if Meowald is to be believed, it would seem you have an uncertain future ahead. Hey! Oh, there's no point in speculating now. Perhaps Defiance Bay holds the answers we need. I want to discuss something else. How may I be of service? Tell me about Adir. I've been gone for more than a year now, but I suspect I'll always think of the forests and fields of Adir as home, with thousands of years of history and traditions behind us, and there's a sense of dignity and responsibility that comes with that. He frowns. Of course there's baggage as well. Our imperial past is still fresh in the minds of many, as you may have noticed here. Has it been difficult to adjust to the to deep the root? People here are informal, hot-blooded. His mouth twists into a wise smirk, more attentive to insult than to duty. But as long as one avoids provocation, it's easy enough to get along. He stipples his fingers. I gotten accustomed enough to keeping my thoughts to myself, anyway. How long were you in Gilded Vale? He shrugs, fidgeting with the hem of his sleeve. Not much longer than you. As you saw, it was hardly the heaven that had been advertised. Hmm. Any thoughts on what I should do next? He tags at his sleeves. Merwald ur urged you to seek out these late key agents in Defiance Bay, yes? If this... if his condition is any warning, we should find them with all haste. Thank you. 
That old watcher. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but it sure wasn't that. You said you had some things you wanted to ask him. Nah, it's... Well, it's kind of embarrassing now. I just got a dumb idea in my head is all. Don't know why I thought it'd work. That's funny. That's probably the first thing I got my hopes up for in... I don't know. Years. At least I got that out of it. There's no need to be embarrassed. I won't judge. All right. Yes, fair is fair, and you did bring me to see him. Those rumors back in Gilded Vale about my brother, Woden. About how he'd turned against us and fought for Widewin. Been on my mind for some time now. The thing about Woden was, he always knew what was right, and that's what he'd do. One day he set out to fight for Deerwood against a man claiming to be our god. So I knew that's what I had to do, too. It was right. The hearing claims that he died fighting for Ray at Saris, and that got me worried. Not that he'd chosen the wrong side, but that I had. Didn't seem right what Widewin had in store, but if he really was Aethys... He shakes his head. I thought, maybe this old Watcher would know how my brother died. So I could see if it was true. Like he could, I don't know, read it in my soul or something. Use our connection. Told you it was dumb. Why didn't you ask me for help? I don't know. Guess because I didn't know you. It's hard to trust a stranger that says she's a water. True. Of course I knew the truth deep down. The watcher's not psychic. I think I just had this idea, and the idea made me feel a certain way, and I didn't want to lose that. Really, if I wanted to find out about my brother, I shouldn't be starting with watchers. I should be starting with records. So why don't you? Either thinks a moment, his lips twisted to one side, he raises his eyebrows. If there was anything written down about it, they would have it in Defiance Bay. They got an archive at the palace. You've done a lot for me already, but if you could see fit to pay that archive a visit with me, well, you know. Knowing my luck, the records clerk will go crazy and try to kill me. I'd feel better with you in there with me. My pleasure. Yes. It will be my pleasure to, <laughs> to do that. Let's burn that archives as well. If we'll have the same luck I had in Tyranny with the I game imagine. randomly breaking, then we will burn the whole world. Literally. I felt Mayor Ward's passing. You slew him. He gave me no choice. It saddens me to hear it, but part of me is grateful to no longer have to wait and worry in darkness. This place has always known its master, long as it's had one. It has a will all its own, which has little to do with the castle and much to do with the land it's built on. It looks to you as Meerwald's successor now, whether you care for it or not. A dubious honor, inheriting a fortress both broken and cursed. But in the right hands, it could be so much more. If you had only seen it in its day, will you... will you stay? I've always wanted my own keep, even if it's a little cursed. You feel that same emanation of warmth and energy in the air. Then it is yours, my lady. I cannot begin to tell you how glad that is how good it is to know that the keeper's incapable hands once again. I suppose I should mention first that if you mean to travel to Defiance Bay for supplies, there has been a complication of a kind. The Eastern Barbican collapsed decades ago, and Mayor Wood never got around to rebuilding it. The road here is a dead end. He got as far as gathering materials before he became... Preoccupied. I could 
make arrangements to have it repaired, if it is your will. When it ceased to be the previous master's will, I became powerless to do anything about it, for what I am but the master's instrument. It would take time, but far less than finding another route to the finance bay. How do I repair it? May I will set aside materials for the barbican, and they are still available to you. In the future, if you wish to make further repairs to the keep, you will need coin for supplies and labor. What does being the master of Kate Noah entail? Why, there are many responsibilities involved in maintaining a keep. The extent to which you wish to get involved is entirely up to you, of course. Part of the reason I am here to ensure that things run smoothly in your absence, provided we have been given instructions. If you instruct me on which repairs you wish to conduct next, I will make the necessary arrangements. These may take some time to finish, but it will provide you with additional resources once they are complete. Given somewhere to place them, we can hire tradesmen to provide you with supplies or ingredients. Repairing the keep will raise your prestige and draw both helpful individuals and unwelcome attention from bandits and opportunists. If we can raise the keep's security in turn, these will become less of a concern. You should know, however, that the position does come with some risk. Your name will grow in fame and you must contend with threats to the keep. And then, there are other things. Was there anything else, my lady? What did you mean when you said this keep was cursed? Merrill's curse was his own, a watcher's curse. But his predecessors have not feared, fared better. There is a presence within the keep, or rather far beneath it. At least such has been the conclusion drawn by all who have come to this place, for what spirits still linger in the endless paths of speak of a master below. Every effort to settle here has failed, from the time of our Iderian colonists onward. Beasts rise from the endless paths until the new lord or lady is no more. The one who dwells below, this master, does not tolerate rivals, it seems. I have seen, from time to time, intrepid explorers descend to lay claim to what answers they can, but none return. This is the force which has kept Kate Noir Baron Ruin, and robbed me of my hopes. The endless paths! That, my friend, is where I must go, where we must go, if you will go with me. Whatever devils lie beneath, think too what knowledge we will find. Perhaps this master speaks Adrian. <laughs> but what are the endless paths? The endless paths of Old Noir. That is the name given to the labyrinth beneath the keep. The Earl, he. We were warned by the Glanfadans that this site was cursed, and there is a legend attached to it. Though, at the time, we thought nothing of it. The ruins were built, it is said, by a powerful Antwinian named Odnua, who ruled there until his people turned against him. They destroyed his endless paths and filled many of the upper tunnels in with soil and stone. No one living knows how far down the tunnels stretch, and few who have ventured there have returned. There is much talk of riches and treasure, the promise of anguish and relics alone, and draw many fortune seekers to their deaths, I fear. Who is Master Bill? I could not say with any certainty. I believe it must be tied to the man said to have been the architect of the Endless Paths, the Envidian tyrant, Old Nua. Some claim his spirit endures, or at least has laid a curse upon the side. I cannot imagine much remains of his work, for the ruins have been here a thousand years or more. But what is left is impressive. The arrow certainly thought so. You may have seen well below the hand of the great statue Old Nua constructed. Perhaps it is a statue of Old Nua himself. But I am 
Am I not the master of Cape Noir? Of course you are! The keep would have no other. But the endless paths are a different thing entirely. It is unfortunate, really, that they are so closely entwined. If the master below is not dealt with, there will always be a threat to the keep from within. I... I know it is much to take in, but if you would remain, if you would master this place, then I can only advise you to seek out this foe before it destroys you. Uh, oh, oh, all right. I but I have all the questions. Well, apparently not. Time to find this queen in the city of the files. You must know this queen you're looking for. The files bay has no queen. The McQueens of Adrian haven't reigned here since the war. The only queen with any power there is Woodika. I am told they erected an exquisite temple in her honor there, but I was never able to see it. If you mean to go there, we can get started right away on repairing the barbican. You need only tell me what you wish to do, and I will make the necessary arrangements. Merald kept a letter, as it happens, and I have taken the liberty of updating it. You could take a look if you wish. Okay, let me see what repairs I can make. Then we'll get underway at once. The steward's voice bellies a giddy excitement. Know, my lord, that this is but the first and least of a great many undertakings. The keep supported a great many buildings and servants for many years. If you should wish it, we can repair some of the outlying structures, and these will bring you wealth and recognition, drawing people to your service. Rebuilding the defenses will keep your grounds from becoming overrun, as they did under Mel Ward's keeping. You need not choose all at once. I am pledged to your aid, and so long as you are master here, we shall always be linked. You need not step upon these grounds to speak with me. Wherever your travels may take you, you can make your will known to me, but if you but reach out. Oh, but, but first, of course, the barbican. Great. So this is what entirely... okay. I cannot check what those are. Oh, here. Prestige and security. Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Main keep. Yeah, I have enough. And... Bright Hollow. Restoring Bright Hollow will allow you to rest there. Other upgrades can unlock resting bonuses for it. Yeah, but we definitely need main keep. The wooden trails around the domain of your keep. Upgrading them will grant both a construction and athletics bonus when resting at Bright Hall. Sure. Oh. Okay, so we must wait for main keep to be done. Mm -mm -mm. It is good to see you here, my lady. I can feel a change in the air already. There is much to do. Is there anything I can do to help? What is the state of the keep? Ah, where to begin? Let's see. Okay, so this is how I go into this. We have the ladder. The upgrades are here. Hirelings, party management. So we will have six. Finally, okay, that's an upgrade. Uh, six party members total, with a party more that we can recruit. That is great. And you want to talk? I confess, I was hoping our meeting with Mayor Wald would go a little differently. But then, you have gained an entire keep. I don't think I've seen anyone inherit land that quickly since Kind the Younger read her father's will. Well... I did come to the Deerwood looking for a new home. There, see? The ship falls yet. This might be good news in the end. Whatever else happens, you have an entire castle to explore. And Arthur's yet to come in the Fiance Bay, if Marwold spoke true. It will give you a base from which to go searching at least. And then, there are secrets beneath the keep yet. <laughs> With you at the helm, it should be easier to explore the endless paths. And I think we'll start with just that. Well, if this is what I think it is. You know, the barrier. 
that was okay. But hurry up, please. The barrier is indeed gone. Here we are. To think we are so close. Beneath our very feet lie the endless paths built by Ard Nua, the great Anguithan king. Well, up here this is all endearing, of course, but should we descend far enough, we will find some real history. To uncover that great king's tomb would be a dream, but it is one of his servants I am after. Gabranos, a powerful mage and a dedicated scholar, a keeper of lore. Just as I mean to be. He was in possession of the Tanvi Oratoa, or whatever form of it preceded the one we know. I've seen it in ruins, alongside Gabranos' name. Scraps of the same symbols and verses we know in Rawatai. He must have held the words in high regard. Or perhaps he was even the author. You sound very impressed by this Gabranos. They say he held power over the elements, <clears throat> but I'm more interested in his writing. He was a prolific author. I haven't been able to translate everything, but I've seen enough to know that he traveled far and wide. If only we could have met him! That What wisdom he could share! But we can follow his example and strive to learn from those around us, improve upon it. You haven't actually read his writing. Well, not entirely. How could I? It's a dead language and hardly anyone has translated even a small fraction of it. But what little I can, I have translated. By comparing the symbols in his work to what others have found, I pieced together a phrase from the Tanvi Oratoa, clear as day. I even gave it to the keeper to check, but she was convinced I'd written it myself. Why does this book matter so much? Rautaya faces troubled times, once we were a unified people, but that's changing, and the Tanu Ratoa is the heart of that. There are those who say that we haven't held to its instruction, that we've allowed ourselves to grow weak and polluted our traditions by welcoming foreigners rather than laying claim to the lands around us, that we must hold to those traditions if we are to make of ourselves a nation to be feared. My brothers have it so, but we don't need to isolate ourselves to make Rotwai Rawatai great. I know there's more to the chant. It wasn't created out by out of sand and water a thousand years ago, but brought to Rautai by the Angwitians. By a people that knew the value of alliances and shared their knowledge with us, and with that knowledge, we made Rautai what it is today. If I can find the original, I can prove it. They will know that the chant is far older than we believe, that the aim with us favored peace and the trade of knowledge. If we follow in their footsteps, we can make a kingdom just as grand and lasting as theirs. How is one book going to change the minds of everyone in Rautai? It's hardly any old text. But I see your point. Kane okay. kinda looks down at his hands, rubbing the webbing between his fingers with his thumb. It might not convince everyone, but at least it will lend way to the call for peace. Are you always this excitable? We're on the verge of great discovery! I wonder at, at your restraint. Well, let's start looking then. If my sources are correct, Gabranos will have brought the text with him. It will probably be within a library. Or a tomb, perhaps. It tends to be one of the two. I cannot argue with that. Let's be off. Let's be off. Oh, we're gonna die. Off to a great start. 
Okay. We have a worm. We have a worm situation. I forgot that. Help him. This worm hates me. Me, personally. Luckily, he misses. I'm here. Stand together. I'm no, I. I say no more. That's, it. That's what. This crooked effigy has been cobbled together with fox scaled hides and bones. A human skull adorns the top. There's blood. Okay, so this is how we do this. Nice and easy. And saving at every turn. Maybe we should be walking like this. Oop. The work of a moment. The two of you move. Okay, you keep hitting him. Really, really. I'm here. Go back to sneaking. Typical. Blade, the blade, the blade. A great ancient weapon has been dismantled. Its pieces thrown throughout the endless paths of Odnua. Perhaps if all these pieces can be found again, weapon can be forged. That is interesting. Certainly. Yep. Hello. 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 <laughs> uh, can I check out this weapon? It looked like a part of a crossbow. Yeah, broken blade. Oh, <laughs> part of a crossbow. Bl broken blade. Yes. Okay. Well, you know what? I think I'll end this part here. So, for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. We'll deal with them first. So, bye.